convenience of M-Pesa, because of the convenience of working remotely, because of the convenience of working online, everything becomes easier and most people want to know, and I know you want to know, what are some of the online jobs that can get you paid on M-Pesa directly? So you want the convenience of working remotely, being online, but you also want to be receiving your money so easily on M-Pesa. Reason for this is a lot of times even when I do business online, sometimes the payment process becomes such a problem, you know, because like PayPal has held my money so many times without releasing it for months, just trying to prove I don't know what. And then you have all these other payment systems that sometimes charge you so much in terms of what be, what is being transferred to you that you're like, why am I even using them? Because they're taking so much fees from you. And uh, of course, we have different methods of payment, like cross-border cross border payments. So you sometimes feel like, you know what, to just make my work easy, my life easier, be in a position to receive my money immediately after working, I need to find something that pays me in M-Pesa, you know, Kenya shilling straight to my M-Pesa. Even if it's coming from a different country, it comes straight to your M-Pesa. People nowadays pay straight to M-Pesa. Even those of us who are in the West, when I'm back in Kenya as well, I can do payment both ways on M-Pesa. People pay me from Australia, from the US, from whatever. So it means there are opportunities that you can actually be paid on M-Pesa. So what are some of the online jobs that can pay you on M-Pesa. Welcome to Ken's Money Matters. Remember here we talk about the money mindset, how to make that money, how to enjoy that money, how to invest that money, how to manage that money, and how to assure yourself of a lifetime of income, basically financial freedom. The best one, of course, is the one that I know that I partake in, and that is Forex trading. Now, Forex trading is straightforward, right? It's a skill, like I always say, it's a skill that you have to learn how to trade currencies. So you learn the skill, you open a brokerage account, you start trading, you will get paid in Kenya shillings. So most of the time people say, hey, how do I get my money from this uh, brokerage account? How do I get actual money? Let's say I go in, I trade AUD, USD, it goes well, I make some money, how do I get my money back? Of course, with Forex trading, once you open the brokerage account, you're now easy, you can always just trade. Once you trade, and if the brokerage is in Kenya and they have the M-Pesa facility, when you go to withdraw your money, the same way you deposit your money, if you go to withdraw your money, they can ask you if you want to withdraw it to your M-Pesa. You put the number that you registered with or that put in the system and the money will come straight to your account. So that's one thing that you can do. But remember, I always say Forex trading requires skill. You have to train. It's not gambling. You have to train properly. Learn how to do both fundamental and technical analysis. Know what you're doing in the markets. Know how to make your money consistently. And that's what matters consistently. And that way, you will be fine. You will be paid through M-Pesa and the money will be straight into your phone. No hassle, no issues. Then the second one is online writing. So online writing is a big one as well. It's a big thing in Kenya right now. It's a big thing in Africa, generally speaking. A lot of people are into online writing. Now with online writing, I'm going to divide them separately. The first one is academic writing. If you're doing academic writing, there are so many opportunities. People pay you on M-Pesa. People from Canada, from the US, from the UK, from all these Western countries that people are studying, they pay you on M-Pesa. So if you want to do an online source that gives you money straight to your phone, you do academic writing. Now, there are different sources for academic writing uh, that you could actually go to. There's Study Pool, there's S.A. Sharks, there's Edison, there's Falcon. There are many places where you can actually get these um these jobs for online writing specifically academic writing it's a, it's a really good source of income if you're still in school if you're a student looking for some side hustle that you can do it sharpens your mind uh, it also sharpens your researching skills it just makes you much better in you know in, in 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 absorbing stuff and learning new things and being versatile and working with different people around the globe so i think the skills that come with it are not just about the the writing or the money itself i think there's just so much around it that it can help with as long as you don't remain stagnant and stop you know, pursuing your career goals because you're getting that money, then it can be a very good side hustle. Then under online writing, we have blogging. And this is something I've spoken about so many times. You can, If you're good at writing, if you have content, if you have something that you want to tell, if you have a niche that you need to focus on and you feel you can provide some value when you start blogging, this is another area to go into. You can go into blogging, write content, and you will always get so many people to pay you for the content, especially if you become a brand, brand ambassador, if you're partnering with different people. So blogging also pays. Blogging pays, especially if you can drive good traffic to that particular blog or that article or that site, blogging will pay you and straight to your M-Pesa. 
there are many ways you can start blogging you can even blog for other people as well i've seen people who are travelers they look for people who can write articles for them for their blogs so that's another channel whereby you can make money online and still get paid through mpesa under writing again you could talk about resume writing nowadays i've seen a lot of people applying for jobs and there are standards that are required when it comes to cvs and resumes basically guys don't just go applying for jobs with this outdated crazy similar content cvs every job requires its own cv and this is a very good niche if you can focus on in making like really good international standard cvs and now in this era people are looking for jobs all over the world so they need really good cvs for them to be in a position to compete all over the world and it's not just about the traditional cvs we used to make it's not just something that you make lazily or quickly or hastily and think it will just pass there are more sophisticated ways in which employers are using to eliminate CVs and so the first hurdle is getting your CV through the door and making it accepted and that's a big big area most people haven't uh, evolved and haven't actually grown to know what it, what is expected of them so there's an area that if you get into and you get to know what you're doing and you get to provide value that people can actually point to you will make money so with most of these writing uh, jobs that are apart from academic you can find them on fiverr on upwork on freelancer.com you can find them on career point there's so many sites where you can find these jobs just google these jobs and you will always find like a list of sites where you can find them i think i've done a video on the sites that are best for some of these jobs but yeah check that out writing gives you a lot of opportunities and freedom and earning potential as well then we have affiliate marketing now this is one of my favorite whereby you promoting another product or a service if someone buys it you get some your commission out of that particular purchase or that sale now with affiliate marketing sometimes you need to drive traffic you need to be in a position to uh, have followers and stuff like that but it doesn't require so many sometimes it doesn't even require you to have followers you can even do boosting you can do advertising for these products Whichever way you look at it, affiliate marketing is one way you can make money easily. You basically promote some other products. When people buy them, you get your, uh, your commission. A lot of you have people around them, have families, have friends, have where they can basically market any product. Or you're using this product yourself and therefore you want to market it to other people. So this is something you might want to think about. So affiliate marketing is a really good area to focus on and to think about if you are someone who is into let's say content creation or you are someone who just have people around them that you can easily you know drive traffic to a particular product or service and then people can buy it and in kenya right now i think mainly it's jumia and kilimall these are some of the places that you can get really good commissions on affiliate marketing then the other one is virtual assistance this is whereby you take care of administrative tasks for different people around the globe could be me could be someone someone somewhere else could be anyone you know so as a virtual assistant you're just helping them manage their work it's one of the best jobs you can actually do it gives you freedom you can do it from wherever you want to do it from and it pays based on the client you're working with and based on the experience you have and the value you're giving again as a virtual assistant you get paid on mpesa so the money comes straight to your phone there are so many opportunities again as, uh, for virtual assistant upwork fiverr freelancer.com guru um so many job portals that offer this career point all these places check out find an opportunity to start providing these services and if you want to train there are many people that provide these services to train ask me in the comment section i'll guide you to someone who does proper training for virtual assistants and then next is online tutoring now if you have knowledge in any area you are someone who understands data you are someone who understands engineering you understand mathematics you understand physics you understand music you understand whatever you can provide those services there are so many people out here trying to learn other skills like even me there are skills i'm trying to learn like for hobby you know whereby if i find someone who can actually give me really good lessons online then i'll jump onto that opportunity and most of these tutoring um, classes just require you to use the current skills that you have so you don't have to go and learn something new you are using what you currently have in your life what you currently practice and what you do is pass that knowledge from yourself and from the field and then to these new people online tutoring i think it's one of the best ways to make some passive income some side hustle if you have that kind of knowledge and most of us have some kind, some kind of skill or knowledge that we can always pass across this again contributes to the community in ways that surpasses money you know this is how you leave a mark in your community you teach one or two people you've just left your mark this is how you contribute to the growth of our community so online tutoring go for it so there are many places you can get this we have teacher on we have tutor vista we have schooly we have preply so we have quite a number of them that you can actually find these opportunities on there are many places you can find 
opportunities for online tutoring not only the ones i've just mentioned then of course the one that is now a big thing social media management sometimes even me i know i need someone that has to do this for me this is a big area some of us are busy doing other stuff you know but we can produce content we can do videos we can we have lots of information we can pass across we want to create content but we have no one to manage all the social media properly this is a good job and if done well this can pay you really well and this pays to your pesa i have people have helped me you know on occasions to manage my social media and then i pay them so yeah social media ma media management if you are up to it you like it you like being online you are like creating that visibility this is another area you want to look into then we have data entry this is a simple one no skills required most of the time you just basically enter data into spreadsheets or into whatever document you've been given whatever format you are always given all the instructions anyway all you need to do is to enter data most of en data entry jobs will pay you on mpesa as well no skills required you can do them at night if you're a student you can do them at any time when you're free they're very flexible and they're all over the place you look at career point indeed all these job platforms will always have these opportunities so look into data entry as well and last but not least is drop shipping drop shipping is whereby you are basically selling a particular product that you do not actually have at the point so you don't stock them you don't have them in your house you have a product you advertise it someone pays for it once they pay for it you pay the supplier the supplier sends the product straight to that person so you're basically a middleman and you don't need to stock anything you don't need to deal with all this ledger stuff you don't need to deal with all the books basically all you need to do is ensure that the person pays is you advertise properly someone buys it and then you pay the supplier supplier sends the product to the person who has paid and then you make your money depending on how high you marked up the price again it's just a capitalistic system that's how it works and i hope that helps you guys so these are some of the jobs you can actually do online and get paid on mpesa it makes your life easy it becomes convenient for you cheers guys i'm out